You know, it simply said the most dangerous time in any kind of domestic violence case is when what usually is the woman is trying to leave the relationship. It's absolutely the most dangerous, heinous time. Patrice, William, Patrice Wilson, by all accounts, was a hardworking woman, great mother, great family person, and well respected in her job as a nurse at the Detroit Medical Center. She was simply trying to live her life, work hard, and break off a relationship that she knew was not good for her. The defendant was a man that allegedly would not leave her alone, would not respond to her wishes to leave her alone. Again, the most dangerous time, the most violent time for domestic violence victims when she's trying to leave. People were outraged when they heard about this particular case of someone that was taken forcibly from their job at the end of their shift. But unfortunately, this is what we see all the time in domestic violence cases, especially those that determine homicides. The evidence in this case will show that this defendant was responsible for the death of Ms. Wilson and the other crimes that we are, and they are numerous, that we are alleging today. Today we are charging, and I've authorized the following charges for, against um, Jameer Miller, one count of first degree murder, one count of felony murder, one count of carjacking, one count of armed robbery, one count of felon in possession of a firearm, and five counts of, uh, one count of felon in possession of a firearm, and five counts of felony firearm. The defendant will be arraigned today at 36th District Court at 1.30 p.m. All of the details and all the details of the extensive investigation that was done by the Detroit Police Department, assisted by our office, by the Special Victims Unit, extensive work that was done. It will all be displayed in the courtroom at the preliminary examination and later at the proceedings in this case. Thank you. Chief. Thank you, Madam Prosecutor. I just want to thank you and your team for their hard work. I want to thank the members of the Detroit Police Department, specifically our homicide unit, uh, for this very, very sad case. Uh, hopefully this brings some degree of closure to the family uh, and, and certainly uh, justice to this family. The work that everyone has put into this case, this senseless act of violence, uh, should not have happened. Uh, but I'm very happy uh, with the prosecutor's work, the charges. Uh, I've never seen a relationship with our two agencies be better than it is now. We're going to continue to work very hard uh, with the prosecutor's office. So that's all I really have. just want to say thank you uh, for this case and the hard work that went into it. And thank you, Chief, and your team for what you've done in this case. It was extraordinary. Thank you. Let me just repeat those charges again since I bossed them up a little bit. One count of first-degree murder, one count of felony murder, that's first-degree premeditated murder, one kind of carjacking, one kind of armed robbery, one kind of felon in possession, and five counts of felony firearm. Again, he'll be arraigned today at 1.30.